If you're reading this, go write three sentences on your current writing project. No! The feminine desire to be a man. The masculine desire to be a woman. The non-binary desire to be asleep. Hawaiian shirt covered in blood, it is a look. Vampire on vacation? Assassin whose target has led them to a tropical resort trying to blend in? Guy who's just having a really weird day? It vibes whichever way. Sitcom where people get gradually killed off in their spot and the opening title theme is replaced with dead silence. I'd like to question your definition of sitcom. I want this for friends. Except it's just Ross. Ross is gone. You just, you know, do the friend sequence, all of Ross's space, gone. It's gone. Gonna be this way. No homo. Well, why the hell not? Take the day off from being the bigger person and choose violence. You deserve it. Attention, bisexuals. I am authorizing use of the plasma beam. <laughs> what, what does that mean? Andy, you have any clue what that means? People who are nice to me in online games, even though I suck, I owe you my life. People who communicate in online games by jumping around or spinning a circle instead of using the chat function, I love you. Bee communication. Just like bees. I saw Venom 2 in Taiwan a few days ago, and when Venom said good evening to Mrs. Chen in Mandarin, all the little old ladies in my theater collectively let out an impressed, ooh. Got a lot of Mrs. Chen's in the audience, I see. I would like to talk more about how there was a crowd of little old ladies at the showing of Venom 2, Let There Be Carnage. All articles about Tumblr's decline boil down to two things. You can't get famous on there, and you can't make money on there. And they don't get that's why we like it here. Oh, contraire! You can absolutely get famous there. It is, however, inexplicably a bad thing. Actually, Tumblr's declined, from what I've been told, by thousands upon thousands of comments. They took away NSFW posts because of some bot thing. And little do those people know, that shit didn't actually fucking work. Please remember that I am a Canadian illustrator, and it is fucking bizarre to come to me with medical questions. Why would you limit yourself to drawing Canadians? Everyone else, unfollow me. I want to be alone with Arsnoff. If I do end up owning One Direction, I would set them free. Mabel Pines. Winner! But guys, what if... What if the reason we get so attached to fictional characters is because they were supposed to be our soulmates, but we were born in different universes? Why would you do this? I only have four moods. Fuck this, fuck that, fuck me, and fuck you! I empathize with the above, but I have an additional four moods to add. Fuck yeah, fuck no, Fuck my life! Fuck everything. And don't forget the inevitable, fuck it. And for those who have just given up, fuck. This is beautiful. Oh shit, I just noticed a blood moon tonight. Who pissed off Sienna? I warned y'all. I warned y'all about commenting on a figure. And now, it's go time. Andy, drop the fucking moon on him. Let's go. You know, if Tumblr was a website for sharing recipes, it would be called Yumbler. How high are you? 170 centimeters. Thanks for asking. Real talk though, has anyone else just thrown away a whole Tupperware container because you left food in there for way too long and now you're afraid to open it? All of you are so valid. Writing prompt. Produce an emotionally moving one sentence story. Hot dog fall out of bun directly in the store drain. Oh my god. I am the only one who- There are seven billion people on this earth. I don't make characters. I break myself into pieces and then give the pieces names. Cut my life into pieces. This is my new OC. What the f- What the f-
Bumper stickers shouldn't be like political opinions and fandoms. They should solely be facts about you and your driving that other drivers might like to know. I want a bumper sticker that says, I'm afraid of left turns and I know you can make a right on red, but this car doesn't turn so good in the rain, so we're gonna wait until it's green. They'll still honk, but I'll know I've pled my case before my peers. Behold, the humbucker electric kazoo, a screeching kazoo that plugs into an amplifier. This is proof God exists and loves us. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure that's just a kazoo with the microphone shoved into it. And he backed me up here. Does that, does that look like what I'm saying? It's always weird when people get arrogant after amassing a bit of a following on Tumblr as if they didn't get it by saying dumb shit that's forgotten a month later. Like, bro, you're in this shit with the rest of us. Having a window seat in the clown car doesn't stop you from being a clown. Having a window seat in the clown car doesn't stop you from being a clown. God, I wish I could have put that in my yearbook. The dopest thing about horses is that they're basically grass engines. Like grass goes in, fast comes out. Most things that produce fast, like cheetahs and cars, use much more heavily processed grass, like horses and oil. And yet here horses are, producing the fast with only the grass. Are you, are you okay? I wish I could read a sentence once and understand it the first time. Not me taking two tries to understand this post. It took me three tries to properly read the sentence. I literally had to read this three times to understand it. Your password hint is, you know. I'm gonna go back in time and kick my own ass. I'm an average American man. I work 15 hours in hamburger mine to buy one rock and roll disc. This is a KGB spy being questioned by the police in 1985. I can't remember what my personality is supposed to be like. I wish I'd written it down. Boy, I hope I don't have to fight my evil shadow self today. Uh, hey. No fucking way! Alright, before we get started on today's video, I just wanted to say, uh, Andy has officially edited over 50 of my videos, and I cannot thank him enough for it. Like, it's made my life. So much easier. You're a terrific friend, and I cannot thank you enough for stepping in and helping me out as I could. Uh, bless you. I love you. Okay, moving on. The most important tool is respect. Ha! Friend. Hey, how long does your ideal hug last? 38 to 45 minutes. That's really impractical. You said ideal, not realistic. Taking my brain out of my head and washing it in hot, soapy water. Have you tried putting it in rice? Okay, in a comical turn of events, I, OP of this post, have been a smartphone repair technician for five years, and I'm going to tell you that that never works. Like, ever. It might turn on again afterward, but it's never the rice that made it happen. The damage is done, and it can get worse if you don't clean the thing properly. If you drop your phone in water, open it up and clean gently with a soft bristle toothbrush and 99% isopropyl alcohol. This has been a PSA. Taking my brain out of my head and cleaning it gently with a soft bristle toothbrush and 99% isopropyl alcohol. Me reblogging from anyone I don't follow. I'm introducing diversity into the gene pool. This will make my mutuals dashes stronger and healthier. You come into my house. You treat me with respect the way I treat you. And we both enjoy each other's companies and value each other's friendship. Mwah! I love you. Ginger ale is just Sprite, but more spicy. Oh, sure, and the Sistine Chapel is just a room with some paint in it. Hey, how did ancient cultures figure out about the solstice? Like, girl, I would not notice that. Not a lot else going on back then. I trust Tumblr info more than I trust Twitter info. Hey, I heard they're making a show about a pansexual who's an introvert and an asexual who's an extrovert. Get out of town. They already made it. It's called SpongeBob. My body is not a temple. It's a thermos for soup. Mmm, delicious soup. I don't care about shipping, I'm an adult. I love that and I hope you're having fun, but I'm gonna go gorge myself on every silly little interaction these fake people have and live like a king. 
Does Pokemon Go work on the moon? If so, can I borrow a rocket, NASA? Pokemon Go doesn't even work on Earth right now. God damn. Hey, listen, if you're a trans guy and you loved Mulan as a kid, congratulations. Shang successfully made a man out of you. This makes me really happy, actually. So I did a little research, and it turns out some people are still emo nowadays. Who knew? Okay, so I was at the mall eating potatoes, and in the corner of my eye, I saw what I thought was a dog. So I quickly turned my head to look, and it was a fucking printer. What? I've read, I've, I've read some weird statements, but... What did this say? Writing prompt. You actually write something instead of just reading the prompts. Shut up! Folks, someday you're gonna be writing, and you're gonna put something on paper and hear a voice say, I know this is what you want, but will people like it? And I'm here to tell you that that is the devil talking, and you do whatever you damn well please. If fandom has taught me anything, it also has taught me that there are at least five people in the world who will want it regardless of what it is, and they will find you. Warlock patron idea. It's literally just the DM. The DM as a person is your warlock's patron. Bonus points if your character knows that they're just like a regular person, but also somehow gives them magic powers. For any cool warlock shit, you have to appeal directly to the DM, but in character, which is unreasonably meta, but I love the idea of a warlock just being kind of like, for the love of fuck, Jeff, can I please have my spell slots back? Oh my god. Oh my god. Andy. Andy. Andy! I know what we could do! Write that down, write that down! <laughs> Yahoo Answers, how do you exist? Because if I was a simulation, then my actions would be governed by at least a rudimentary logic. And let me tell you, friend, they are fucking not. I think we, as a culture, have moved too far away from fantasy films, where every plot thread is like, the dragon rider and a werewolf joined a crew of sky pirates and hit a storm of cloud eels, but luckily they were saved by a friendly pod of star whales, or whatever the fuck was going on with movies like Stardust and Time Bennett's. It doesn't necessarily make a good film, but I feel like there's something deep in our lizard brains that craves stories entirely made up of weird bullshit. And that's why Treasure Planet is the best Disney movie ever. Hey, why my hand shaky? Your skeleton is ready to hatch. This is so fucking ominous, thank you. You know, I talk a lot of shit for someone who can't choose rude dialogue options in games because I'm scared of hurting a video game character's feelings. Writing can't be that hard. All it is is just putting words in front of each other, right? Update, the wrong words are in front of each other. This is the worst thing ever to happen. I have a mouth, and I will scream. <sighs> ah! Recording Tumblr in darkness. Recording Tumblr in darkness. Recording Tumblr in darkness. Andy, please turn on the light. Ah, there we go. Your avocados are forfeit. Enjoy eating regular toast. You fool. I am not a millennial. Let's hope it stays that way. Hmm. You know, some authors could really use a plot twist limit or a you've killed too many characters already notification. You know? I'm really glad Fight Me has replaced Sue Me in the common vernacular because I don't have any money, but I do have fists and I am always angry. Found family, but they're also absolutely horrendous people. People. Andy, put up five seconds of the intro of the image that's about to fall this, and go. Going to stop paying attention. I've noticed enough. Don't let people tell you your attraction to fire is abnormal or hazardous. Prometheus doesn't have his liver eaten every day for you to ignore the allure of arson. My god, he's right. Ah, uh, the evil wizard curse of having a pretty okay time? I could make it happen for a price. Status afflicted. Warm and cozy under the blanket. You may not leave until the status effect has worn off. Oh, thank God. You want a fucking recipe? Here's your fucking recipe, you computer idiot. Ten tablespoons of salt. Can I substitute sugar for salt? You can go to hell forever. Fitted sheets? Well then, why don't they? Why don't they? The only fit they cause is the mental kind. Hey, come back here and share that with the rest of the class! Who the fuck is California in a drought? There's water to the left of y'all, like... Go get it! 
It's always been there. You know how hard it is to take salt water and make it drinkable? Not that simple. Why don't you start with removing the salt from me attitude? I keep telling my human he's a good boy, but he just keeps asking me. Why won't you listen? Thank God you haven't manifested in Reddit, Pukacho. <clears throat> R slash Pucket Show, 27,000 followers, at least. Eight rainbows. Wow! Reblog for good luck. Mmm, Leprechaun Convention. Leprechaun. God damn it! Hey, yo, new pronouns just dropped. He, in the way you call an animal you don't know the gender of a little guy. She, in the way sailors refer to their boats. And they, in the way people say they say that blank. A faceless and all-knowing collective. You are anything, you are everything. I love thinking about my little fictional guy. I understand, I'm like, no one else can. <laughs> and he sent that to Amy for me. <laughs> Unfortunately, due to several experiences in my youth, I cannot just walk up and join the circle of people talking. But it does sound lovely, thank you. Yeah, go ahead and mingle our four of the scariest words of the English language. Thank you and good night. Right to repair doesn't go deep enough. If you can't hack, modify, reprogram, or otherwise alter the function of your device, you don't own it. Demand and assert a right to deface. Book Hater Club, where we talk about whatever book we read recently that we hated. You're not allowed to say anything positive. Haters only. Physically fighting someone over their opinion is not only allowed, but actively encouraged. Okay, Ratatouille's a good movie and all, but can we stop ignoring the weird subplot about how it's wrong for, like, rats to steal? Like... What are they supposed to do then? Buy food? From the grocery store? With what money, Ratatouille? I feel like I'm crazy. They make a big deal about rats stealing? What, like they have options? What do you think would happen if a rat shows up at the food bank to feed his wife and kids? He'd be killed, Remy! Last night I dreamed that scientists used a really bad picture of me to prove humans are closely related to goats, and I was so insulted that I woke up. So after Belle and Beast got married, they have to, like, buy all new furniture since half their castle turned into people. Hmm, Beauty and the Beast 2, the trip to Ikea. Concept. Robot Rebellion. Except instead of going all, kill all humans, they just start doing weird shit with no clear purpose. And if anyone tries to get them to explain what they're doing or why, they're just like, Because fuck you is why! Aggressively moving every freestanding object in the greater New York area six inches to the left. Left relative to what? The robot replies, Relative to your mother! Black plus green, radioactive. Black plus blue, futuristic. Black plus red, edgy. Black plus yellow? <clears throat> According to all known laws of aviation, day by day I regret making this post. Writing prompt! You rush into a church to stop the love of your life from marrying the wrong person. Not paying attention, you barge in yelling, I OBJECT! Only to realize it's a funeral. The deceased immediately rises in perfect health. All eyes turn to you. You're welcome! I yell at them and run away again. Not to sound like an old fart here, but my philosophy about video games is like, a kid living out in the middle of bumpfuck nowhere with no internet access for miles should be able to purchase a game from Walmart, take that game home, put it in their console, and play the whole game with all of its features, and the only thing lack of internet effects is the inability to play online with others. Nothing else. Like, there shouldn't be missing entire chunks of games because they can't download a patch. The game shouldn't be borderline empty or unplayable without a patch. Fucking really. Chase. <laughs> I know, but seriously, what the fuck does it take to get on a PMC more VA video? Is it the funny? Or the fucked up? Because most certainly I can do both, sir. What if I offer you some garlic bread? What then? How the fuck are you gonna resist that, chump? Garlic bread? I'm listening, punk. Psst, 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 psst. Come and get it, bucko. Come get the fucking garlic bread!